Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Moira and today's video is gonna be something that I have wanted to do my whole life. If you can tell from the title already, it's going to be my room makeover. Oh yes, by the way, I got a haircut. Mm -hmm. So I wanted to redo my room ever since last year because I didn't really love the colors of my walls that much. It was super pink. I love pink, but it kind of felt like I was living in a child's bedroom, which is so ironic because I chose those colors when I was in my first year of college. So I decided to do this room makeover now, like with the new year and stuff. I've always wanted to do room transformations, just like those designers from HGTV, which is actually one of the reasons why I chose architecture in the first place. Anyways, before we get into the room transformation, I just want to show you a quick room tour of what my before room looked like. So this is what you see when you walk into my room. That's my bed. It has some storage space over here. I have this heart collage that I did three or four years ago. Over here is my aircon unit and I have some curtains. Oh my god, look at that. Hanging by like some plastic straw thing. And it still has these things which were from the blinds before it was curtains. So yeah. Then over here I have this table since I needed something to put my laptop on so that when I sit it's very easy and convenient. I have this drawer. Above it I just have my books and a frame that I need to put up. On top of it are some shelves. I have my board games, my friends, pop collection, other pop, other collections and stuff. Over here is my very lovely blue electric fan. Just below it, again, I have a frame that I also need to put up. This is Audrey Hepburn. And behind it, I have like my shoes. I have this little storage box. Over here, I just have my everyday items that I use. This is my doll that I got made for my debut. Here on the shelf, I have like more accessories. I also have some books if you can see right there and just some random stuff. Over here is a box that I don't really know what's in it. <laughs> and then over here, yo, what up? I have my mirror that I use whenever I'm getting ready. I have a picture of Arya Stark. And then over here, I just have more of my makeup stuff and some drawers for my makeup stuff and look at that I still have the curse from my childhood beside it is another display shelf or cabinet before this was me and my parents room and then they moved to a different room so I got all of this to myself but this was still in here because they didn't take it so it stuck with me Ugh. really just filled with all their stuff but I just put some random stuff of mine so that it will still kind of look like it's still my room and above that I also have more of my collect like my Barbie, Lara Croft, the Empire State Building, and this is a random cute Mohon, and then that's squishy. Then behind my door, I have my stuff for scale modeling. There's some random wine. It's my dad. Behind my door, I have my bags, my construction hat, uh, Arky stuff, and then beside it, I have this study table. It's supposed to be a study table, but I don't really use it as one. But anyways, I just have a lot of stuff on it, like my lotions, perfumes, stationery stuff. Customized Coke, look, it says Moira. I have my notebooks, my journal, random stuff. And below it are just some more storage space. And those items in the paper bags are not mine. They're my parents that they need to like check so that I can finally throw them out because it's just taking up way too much space. And then I have another frame that says Broadway because I love Broadway. And over here is my cabinet, my Audrey Hepburn calendar. Again, more of my dolls. And then over here. <laughs> are a bunch of paper bags. I think one, two, three, four paper bags are stuff that I'm going to give away and these are Christmas gifts and those are my mom's and that's mine, my yoga mats and other paper that I use for our key and this is my old mirror that I still have yet to throw. I just keep on forgetting and I also have another frame that I need to put up and that's it. Okay, now that you have seen my room, let's jump right into the plans. So I made sure to measure all of my furniture so that I can import it and put it here on SketchUp. I did three floor plans so that I have options. So for the first floor plan, I positioned the bed on the longer side of the wall because I think that's the ideal way to do your rooms. And then I put the vanity desk by the window since again, it's also ideal. I put my wardrobe over here. I have some side tables. Basically, there's a lot of things that you can fit in here. But the thing is, if I do this kind of layout, I wouldn't have that much space to move around in. Walkways are very narrow. For option B, this is kind of similar to the layout that I have 
right now. So I put my bed in the same position and then I put like a small bench on the foot of the bed so that it could be a place to sit since my cousins come here to my room a lot. Again, I have a wardrobe. I just put everything else on this wall right here. So I have my drawers, the vanity desk, and the display cabinet. I like this layout because it's very spacious as you can see, but at the same time, it doesn't feel like I just put everything in so that it can fit. If you know what I mean. And for the last option, I put the bed near the windows so that I could maximize the space and probably the foot of the bed there could be like a TV in the future. Have my wardrobe, a vanity desk um, near my bed, and then the display cabinet, and I could also have maybe space for a chair. This layout also has a lot of space, but I don't really love it since it looks like I have wall hugging disease. You just literally put everything against the wall, and I don't really like that look because again it feels like you're just putting it there so that it could fit and you're not really thinking of the design. Ah, Arky problems. Yeah, I chose layout B. So this is a perspective of what I envision this room to become. I want to have white walls so that again it will feel more spacious and it will be brighter. And I guess the longer side of the wall I want to do like a gallery wall of all the frames that I own. I some throw pillows, change the curtains to a different color, probably find a bench so that people can sit and stuff. Here, I have my drawers and my shelves that I want to paint white. I want to buy like my, a vanity desk with like a legit vanity mirror with lights and stuff because that's also one of my dreams. And then I want to get this chair that's on wheels, prop, like an office chair, but a chic office chair so that I could easily move around. On this side, I will still have my display cabinet, but I will probably cover the glass with um, sticker paper or something so that I don't have to see what's inside of it since I feel like it's still going to be messy inside. On the other side of the wall, there's going to be my wardrobe. I want to have a sliding wardrobe with mirrors so that I could check myself out all the time and I don't know, I just really want a full length mirror. But that is it for this video. Make sure to check out my next video which will come out probably in a few days where I actually start with the transformations. Anyways, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye!